Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this video I will show you how to install this outdoor outlet at your home. I will be using this outlet to run our outdoor lights, but you can use it for any other purpose as well. It's not that hard, I spent about one hour on the whole project. So let's start and I will show you all of my steps. Ok, let's start. First you have to find an inside outlet that will be close to your new outside outlet location. So you can use it for your wire connections. As you can see I found this outlet and now I try to find this stat. So you can use this method or you can use a stat finder to locate your stat. Before you start you need to turn off your power, it's very important. Go to your main panel and find the breaker that is responsible for this specific outlet and turn it off. So let's start to remove this outlet panel. And now I want to get a rough idea on where this outlet is going to be located outside. So I will do this with tape measure starting from the window pane. And after that I will move to outside and do the same. So everything looks good and correct. Now I can drill a hole for the wall. I have this small bit. Ok, we are ready to install our outdoor outlet. Let me show what I have for this project. I have a piece of wire left over from my previous project. I have a wire conduit, a stat finder, knife, a few connectors, a GFI and voltage tester. And also, most important, I have this outdoor outlet kit which I bought at Home Depot. So you need this kit if you want to install your outdoor outlet or something similar. Okay, let's move to our next step. As you can see, we now have a small hole in the wall which we drilled from our indoor outlet. So I will drill a bigger hole to fit this piece of conduit because I will run my wire through this conduit to protect it from any damage. <laughs> Okay, now we can run a wire through the wall. Yeah, we we'll have this wire, it's left over from my other project. Okay, we have our wire here outside, so it's real nice here. Yeah. And now we will use this pipe and attach to the wall to protect our wire. So before I will use silicone, I have that silicone, so I will use it for waterproof, just in case. Okay, now we can use our box and now we can connect our box to the wall. I have this level, let's check our level. So everything looks good. So, 
Okay. Now we have a wire here, so let's go uh, inside and connect our wire to the indoor outlet. Okay, let's prepare everything for our connection. We need to uh, cut uh, about 12 inches of wire, open this and have these three small wires, black, white and neutral. So we will use these three wires for our connection. So we need to connect these three wires to the current outlet and after that use this one, this device. First one, make sure that you don't have power here, just double check. Yeah, it's no power. It's pretty simple. You will connect your black to the black side. I will show you. Yeah, connect your black to this one. I have black here, so you can connect here. In this type of outlet, you just need to push the current, this wire, something like this. See, and it's locked. So we have black, black. And for the white, the same. We have white here, so we'll connect other white here. And I have a, it's a cold white, let me show you. As you can see, this is white and black here. So for the white, I will just push and connect, something like this. Okay, so we have black, we have white. Now we will use this one. Just push and as you can see, it's already here. You push it and it stay here. And for the white, we'll do the same. And for the ground, We'll use, we'll push this one. So now we have our ground from the line connect to the our outlet. And now we need to clean this wire. Okay, now we need to connect. Black to the black. Connect it. Uh, ground to the ground. Connect it. Ground to the ground and white to the white white to the white okay now we have all connections here it's all done so i will show you again this is ground yeah this is our original line yeah this is original ground came to this splitter and came to the indoor outlet and go to the outdoor outlet. Same for the white, for the neutral and same for the black one. So we have all wires here connected correctly. So our final step to connect our indoor outlet to the box. So as you remember, we have this kit and so we don't need the long wire, we will cut it like this, maybe on this side, and we will connect our wire to our outlet. Okay, let's clean the wire 
and here we have our neutral hot and ground wires and here uh, we have from this side it's our hot and from this side it's our neutral it's a white and black wire and here it's a ground wire so for the white neutral it's this one and you need to connect to the white side to this side so the black side it's connected to this one to the brass b brass b black and yeah silver it's mean white but this color it's mean connected to the block okay and for the ground you need to connect to this one to the ground So now we have all our connection done. So as you can see, yeah, we have white, neutral, ground, and our black wire from this side. So let's turn on the power and check our connections here. So now it's time to connect, to attach the waterproof cover and start so let's check <laughs> the final check our connection here so let me open this one as you can see okay Let's do it together. Okay, let's start. Okay, everything works perfectly. We have two lights here. So we connected everything correctly. And let's check top. We have two lights here. So we are done our project. Everything works perfectly without any issues. So please let me know guys if you have any questions, comments uh, and I will be glad to respond and help you with this your project. So thank you so much for watching and stay tuned. Bye.